really loud 31. I'm hoping it's going to be a dollar coin or something here. going to do this little field right here. Just checking out the U.S. Coast Guard shipping off. And there's a little tugboat behind it or something. So I've hunted this area before, but uh, <clears throat> didn't really find too much. The ground was super hard, so uh, it just uh, rained overnight, I guess, because the ground's extra wet. So hopefully that'll uh, help out. Stay tuned for uh, a good find. Yeah! <laughs> Anyways, welcome to the channel. Hope you enjoy this episode. If you want to see a badass episode, check out the one before this one. The couple before this one. Well, just a couple pennies so far and some trash. But we got a nice signal here. It's like a 26, 27. It should be trash, but... We're gonna check it out anyways. Oh, it does not look like trash. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that thing. That looks pretty nice to me. <laughs> it's like a second target. I think it's going to be a blingy because it feels kind of light. Still a nice thing to dig out of the ground though. Yeah, a little blingy. Blingy, blingy, bling, bling, yeah! <laughs> Way to start out the day. It's amazing how, uh, how lucky I get. <laughs> That's totally a trash signal, but you know. Now it's uh, going in the ring box. I hope to do 100 rings in a year one day. One year without doing uh, beach hunting. See how that works out. <laughs> It's almost unbelievable. Uh, that happens. I guess if you're going to go out hunting a lot, you will dig up rings right away and then maybe nothing the rest of the day. Who knows? I, I was discouraged by this place when I first dug here a long time ago, over a year ago. Should be a nickel for a uh, whole tab. The cool thing is right, everything's right here and the ground is not tough like it was last time. Looks like we got trash. Scrumped up bottle cap. Got another high tone here. This should be a quarter, I'm thinking. Yep, we're on the board with probably a quarter. Yep, new one. Bam, bam. We have an 18 here, which I don't usually get, so it's probably gonna be trash, but <clears throat> got lucky on the first one. Thinking like a bottle cap or something. No, nope, we got a got a slug with some striations on there. I haven't found these in so long. Maybe it's just because I don't dig up these numbers as much, but I haven't found one in a long time. That's the first one. As you can see here, they're doing some uh, spin outs and whatever here, so this is this area's got a lot of action, so could get lucky. Maybe more more than one ring was flying off their hands while they're going around in circles. This is a solid 17. Don't usually get those either, so. I'm just digging up whatever I can because the ground's soft and it's going slow. I'm gonna be all over the place today. It's like a toasted penny. Just left a one. This was coming out of 30, most likely gonna be a quarter. But I never know what. These targets are a little deeper. Shablammers. Old quarter, probably from the late 60s. 69. This one's in the high, th or sorry, just over 30, so could be anything. Could be a aluminum can, probably. It's weird. Let's do a little lunch in here.
probably gonna be this thing. I don't know what it is, but it's an H. Oh, it could have been treasure. Next time. So, slim pickings, mostly just coins, pennies, dimes and stuff. So I'm gonna go around this area, see what I find. There's a lot more trash here, so I'm gonna go slow, see what I find. I think we got our first old coin. Boom, a weedy. I don't think I found one of those in several hunts. Let's see what year we got. It is a 51. Oh yeah. 51 under the sun. Might have a surface find. Press penny. It could be part of a lure though too. I don't know on this one. Really loud 31. Hoping it's gonna be a dollar coin or something. Or something other than trash, huh? Oh, that's gonna be trash. Oh, it's a so what's left of a cell phone it looks like. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a scale. <laughs> I just found a scale. Wonder what they were using that for. <laughs> Blam. Still something in there. Let's see what it is. Yeah. Trash. Scaling some trash. So I just got a couple highlights so far. That uh, scale was a good one. <laughs> um, couple, couple coin spills, weedy, and a nice little bling ring. I'm not. I'm still looking for tokens and uh, jewelry, silver coins, of course, and uh, foreign coins. So we'll see if I get any of those. Those are on the list. Just found this. Looks like a nine millimeter. Hmm. Not sure, but uh, yeah, finding these again. Yeah, just found another one. This has to be a sprinkler. Car part. Gigantic bar of silver. Nothing obvious. Oh, there's something under there now. There it is. Big bar copper. This could be a silver bracelet. Uh, oh, there's something right there. Can't read what it says, but I think it's definitely a bracelet. It's a small one. It says something in there, so we'll get a we'll get a close up of that. Oh man, I can't see what it says right now. But anyways, uh, I'm gonna leave this spot and head back to a spot where I've already hunted multiple times, and just do a quick hour in there and see if what I missed. I like seeing what I miss, especially when I find good stuff. So this is a little cap. We got this bracelet. We got a weedy. We got this uh, bling ring that was looking pretty good for a sec. And uh, potentially a pressed penny, but it's uh, very flexible. So it could be a chunk of lead. All right, let's go. On to the next spot. See the white tiger? White Tiger. White Tiger. White Tiger. Hey, look at you, little ghost. <laughs> Say hi. 
Oh, you like the little noises? Oh, I thought this was a ring. Looks so good. <laughs> well, I'm just going around this old spot that I like. Just getting all the stuff I miss, so. There might be some gold in here. Not gold, but you know. Something in there. Nice. Just regular guy. This is definitely interesting. I think it's not uh, precious metals, but still a really cool find. Might be some kind of magnet. Got an Egyptian scene here, that's pretty cool. Oh yeah. Hopefully that's a magnet. I'll go right with all my other magnets I find. Blam! Just found a D buckle. D for determined. Finally got a token or a foreign coin or something. It's gonna be a uh, token. Camelot Park, Livermore, California. Ooh, a McDonald's. I might be collector. Oh yeah. So just gonna do about an hour in here roughly and then uh, call it a day. But I'm uh, starting to stack up the finds and fill up the box. So that's what it's all about, having a good time. Starting to get warm out here in California. Stay tuned for the next one. This is just laying on the ground right here. Oh bam, fakey. Looks nice though. Got our first key of the day. Some keyage. Got a fatty fishing weight right here. Oh yeah. Haven't found one of those in a while. Found a little heart thing. It's probably cool when it was new. Not so much now. Got another little fake button. Found this US Navy diving helmet 71741 Boston, Massachusetts. This is really cool. A little relic. It's gonna go with my uh, bracelet. Did find a navy button here before, so got really lucky on that one. Let's see what we got here. This is oh, an earring. Yeah, silver plated. Snazzy. <laughs> Got a weight and a quarter. Great signal. It's kind of part of a tractor or a, a, a tank. Pretty badass. Yeah, I'll find the rest. I think we just got another uh, token here. It's a one dollar. I think it's an EBT coin. Bourbon Village CBT token. Except the other one I got was in good condition. This one's blah blah. Well, that was a really fun hunt. I uh, started off slow, even though I got a ring right away. The slow guy. Look kind of awesome, but it's toasted. Still in good find. This actually turned out to be 14 karat gold filled. So I found a little gold there. Got some uh, ammos. This was really cool. It's a little relic from 41, 71741. It's the tag for the inside of a uh, US Navy diving helmet, Mark V. Got a couple buttons. A couple more in here. Here's part of a watch latch. Got an earring. That was kind of cool. I don't think it's silver. It's probably silver plated at best. 
got the part of a tank there. Got a bunch of weights, fishing stuff, press penny that's toasted, never gonna find out what that is. A couple keys, got this heart thing right here. That was probably gold plated too. Got a couple D buckles. Got this awesome thing right here. This is actually a magnet. A little magnet on the back there, some chain that I found. Really cool find. Even found a calorie shell while I was out there. Looks like it was made as a bead or something, these holes. And then of course the scale. So I guess it's only natural that we have to do a weigh in. See how much uh, we got? Let's do it. Here's where all my little magnets go that I find. I guess I should do it this way. Here's all the little magnet, where all the magnets go that I find. I still gotta clean this one, but this is where it's gonna go. It's gonna go up in here. Oh, look at that. Magnet, magnet, magnet. Here's some other magnets I found. <laughs> there you go. Little scrappy digs. Stew weighing. Time for our weigh-in. Ooh, I don't think we're gonna get a weight this week. We'll have to wait till next week. Thanks for joining me. Yeah!